up up in the sky. It's a bird. It's a plane. It's... I'm hoping that's Henry Cavill. Hello everyone, welcome to Digital Charcuterie. My name is James, thank you so much for stopping by. Please give us a like and a subscribe if you're new to the channel. And don't forget to click that bell to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Today I gotta talk about Superman, specifically Henry Cavill in a lot of ways. But you know, last year we heard J.J. Abrams was bringing on Superman and he hired Tanasi Coates to write the Superman script. Uh, there was a lot of discussion, a lot of talk, is Henry Cavill back? No, yes, no, yes, no. Um, and then they said they were going to make a black Superman, and then all of a sudden, in the, later in the summer, we heard that Michael B. Jordan was going to doing his Val Zod, and this one was going to be Clark Kent. And so, a lot of confusion, a lot of speculation going around, but now it seems like this coach script is coming in very soon. It's almost complete. It's almost ready to be submitted to WB, whatever that looks like now. Who knows what they're going to do, if they even want to do this anymore, or if this is more on the trajectory of what they want to do. Reports are saying that this is actually going to be a period piece, um, but other reports are speculating that maybe this is a chance for Henry Cavill to return. Michael B. Jordan, Val Zod Superman, is opening the door for Henry Cavill's return into the J.J. Abrams Superman universe. J.J. Abrams has a connection with Henry Cavill, and not only a connection with Henry Cavill, but a connection with Henry Cavill as Superman from way back uh, in the early 2000s. He was going to be doing Superman Flyboy, and he actually screen tested with Henry Cavill, and you can see pictures of Cavill in costume right now. So there is a connection there, and if you are going to have a multiverse and a multiverse of Superman, it almost makes sense to include Henry Cavill. Of course, you can get him at the cost that you want him at, but I think he's worth whatever you want, whatever he wants, because the Superman is awesome. He's the best. But anyway, that's besides the point. You, you, once you open the door to the multiverse, and you, it's not even the multiverse, it's the letting the creators create, be the creative voices, like with the Batman, the Suicide Squad, Joker, and I'm gonna even say Zack Snyder's Justice League. When you have all of those, this is what you're in for, right? You can do whatever you want. You can have whoever you want play whomever you want. And so I think it really, really makes a lot of sense for Henry Cavill to return to the role of Superman. Man. Now, this is a period piece, so it might not work with Cavill, but again, multiverse, he could be Superman in a different timeline, different type of story, so it could work and reports. There are people speculating and circulating out there that Henry Cavill is still wanted to be Superman, that he's going to sign this massive contract. These words are still out there flying around. You know, nothing is concrete, no one knows for sure, but it is a possibility still at this time until, you know, we hear otherwise, it's still a possibility. He could still be a part of this code script, the J.J. Abrams Superman, or maybe they go in a completely different direction. My hope is that we get to see Cavill return in some capacity, whether, whether it's Man of Steel 2, which I would absolutely like, or another iteration of Superman, where, you know, maybe they give another director a chance to do their take on Superman, like Matt Reeves got on Batman, and Todd Phillips got with Joker, and James Gunn got with the Suicide Squad. That would be ideal, I suppose, in this new era of filmmaking over at WB after the merger, but time will tell. What do you guys think? Are we gonna see Henry Cavill return in this coach J.J. Abrams Superman, or has Henry Cavill flown away for good? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. Please give us a like and a subscribe, and until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.